guys think it's great when we have a chef on, and it is, but for like the two hours before we do it, We're the starving. whole studio smells so spectacular, and we can't touch the food. In today's Good Day Cafe, we're cooking up a summer favorite. Look at the size of these scallops. They're delicious. Uh, for some of us, this delicate and delicious dish can seem a little intimidating, but our guest chef says anybody can make them, right? All right. That's chef right. Nicholas Armstrong from the restaurant Ciro's in Saratoga Springs. Uh, it's a if you've ever been to Saratoga Springs, Ciro's is the place everybody goes to. Yep. Um, and now they've opened up an outpost right right here in Midtown Manhattan, right? Absolutely. And how's it going here in Manhattan now? Uh, it's going great. You know, we've, we've had um, great feedback. Um, the clientele we've had coming in is, is what we're used to in upstate, so we're very at home here. Describe the food for us. Absolutely. We're going to start off, uh, we're doing a um, day boat scallop. Mm -hmm. with a carnival cauliflower puree, a parmesan crisp, and some basil oil. Okay? It sounds fancy, but there are not a ton of ingredients, right? Yeah. Absolutely not. Anybody can do this, all right? We're going to go ahead. We're going to put our cream in to our pot. We're going to get it heated up. Right? That's heavy cream, right? Heavy cream, yep. Okay. We're going to come right in. Now, you're using purple ca cauliflower. That's right. We call it a carnival cauliflower in the business. Um, basically what it is is they, they just uh, genetically breed them uh, until they get a desired uh, color. But does it taste the same as regular cauliflower? It absolutely does, you know, and, and if you can't get this at uh, your local uh, market, then what white is just as good. Yeah, absolutely. you know, I've seen it sporadically in the, in sure. the supermarkets, yeah. the, the, the purple and the yellow. Okay, so now that we got this working here, we're going to come over, we got our pan hot. Okay. Okay, we're going to put a little bit of oil in there. Olive oil. What kind uh, of oil I'd do you like? I'd like to use a, a blended mix, you know, 80-20, mm -hmm. something of that nature, 90-10. Okay. We're going to put a nice amount, and be generous now, with the salt, okay? For oh, taste. Oh, don't tell me a Bloomberg. Be, be generous, because, <laughs> because this, is gonna help, this is going to help with the sear, okay? Ah. Okay, see, you burn it off, basically. I, okay, I didn't know that. Listen to that sound. So we're going to get it in the pot. Ooh, that's nice. Those are huge scallops. Yes, they are. These are U10 day boat scallops. Chef, how long have you been working with Ciro's? I've been working with Ciro's uh, for about six years now, uh, mostly under the guidance of Tom Dillon, uh, who is a great mentor to me, and uh, his son, Brady Dillon. Well, I, we were just reading, I think, on page six that Bobby Flay was in your play. Oh, yeah, we see him a lot. Bobby has horses, so Bobby races yeah. up there. Yeah. Yeah. He loves right. heroes. Absolutely. And you're doing something with Mariano Rivera tonight in Saratoga? Absolutely. At One Nelson Avenue, the lodge, um, he's having a fundraiser uh, for his fun Mariano Rivera, and it's for different use um, as far as health, well-being, education, things of that nature, so it's really a good cause. Terrific. By the way, we should note, if you cannot read the, um, the chef's outfit, he is a proud graduate of Johnson & Wales, That's I would right. imagine. Absolutely. So we'll give them a plug. No, absolutely. How so. long do the scallops have to cook? Uh, about two to three minutes, depending on the size. So right now, while there's a searing, I'm going to go ahead and talk about our garnishes, okay. our Parmesan crisp. Basically, all you have to do is you just shave a little bit of the Parmesan, you put it on a rubber mat, you put it in the oven, you bake it uh, at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for about 15 minutes or so, and it's a perfect garnish. Bro, and one of those over here? Oh, it's good. All right. Yeah. That's like, excuse me, Chef. Yeah. I like that. Okay, okay. so we're going to come back over here. I actually have some of the uh, puree here, what's well, going to be the puree. This right. is kind of what you're looking for consistency-wise. How long is that? Okay. Uh, about 20 minutes or so. A little okay. bit, a bit of salt. Yeah, a bit of salt. I like salt. A little bit of pepper here. All right, we got okay, about 45 seconds left here. Okay. And come down. We're going to go ahead. We're going to puree it. And then oh, I gonna... love this machine, bro. Yeah. And then we're going to start oh, plating. Fantastic. After you puree it. Okay. We do. We're gonna we're gonna start. Uh, well, we can flip these real quick. Which I'll just use my hand. Okay, I just actually flipped okay. it for you. Oh, okay. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I'm gonna move this because this is what it actually winds up looking like as it's plated. This is a. Start the fish. Right now. Okay. There we go. Time now in the iron kitchen. Just 10 seconds left, chef. <laughs> the heat's on. There we go. Okay. There we go. There we go. 
Oh, don't burn yourself. Oh, okay. You got to work. I got, I got a right. nice mess. You know what? We're going to take a break. We're going to come back, see what this all looks like, and say hello to our Facebook fan of the hour, right? Okay. Beautiful. Don't go anywhere. We'll come back. Stick around. Oh, that looks good. Mm. William Show is. We believe if it's not worth driving, it's not worth building. Tommy Malone, you're our Facebook fan of the hour. We're eating in honor of you today. Thank you so much, Tommy, and thank that lovely woman with you as well. Hey, listen, we want to thank everybody from Ciro's Restaurant. They're in Saratoga Springs. If you can't make it to Saratoga Springs, they're in Midtown on 2nd Avenue and 47th Street. Absolutely correct. Look at the finished product there. Look at this. You know what? We're going to put the recipe on our website, myfoxny.com. Click on the Good Day tab. Chef uh, Nicholas Armstrong, excellent. Thank you very much. All right. Wait, you know what? I think you have to put that down because I have to have a bite. How about you? I'm going to take uh, some of the veg okay. stuff. Thank you so much. Have a good day, New York. Good day, New York. Is it over? Go to myfoxny.com right now for news, weather, and entertainment updates. See the difference on air and online. Good day, New York at myfoxny.com. Brought to you by Verizon 4G LTE. You want to